we were first located in uh, what was then Med Center One. We were a small pharmacy within the building. And it was really the start of walk-in clinics, which has now become known as urgent care, which meant we were open at nights because we needed to be there to help patients get their medication sometimes late. And our agreement with the clinic was that we would stay there till the last patient was seen. So I was working late nights, um, and a lot of them, and had a young family at home. I was becoming a little bit disillusioned with where pharmacy was going with the start of the insurance business really kind of taking over our, our business model. Um, I was scheduled to interview for a pharmaceutical sales job. Um, I was going to leave. I was going to leave pharmacy as uh, as 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 a community pharmacy pharmacist. Um, my boss at the time, uh, when I told him that, pulled me aside and said, "I th really think you should consider looking at what compounding pharmacy is." He 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 was involved in national politics um, and and a national pharmacy organization and he said he had breakfast with somebody who was really at the infancy of what is now known as compounding pharmacy. So I liked making stuff. I loved when we were, you know, making hand creams and we were actually doing some suppositories at the time. We were kind of the go-to place. Other, other people would send those few compounds to us. So I enjoyed it. Um, and I'll say to this day, and there's no question that if I wouldn't have found compounding pharmacy, I wouldn't be a pharmacist today. Um, the, the journey that that's taken me down and, and the adventures, and it's the first time that I felt I really, really used what I learned in pharmacy school. Um, the for formulations and the knowledge of putting things together. Um, it's, it's, really, it's really been a, it's been a wonderful, wonderful pharmacy life. Um, I'm extremely fortunate. I'm extremely proud of Dakota Precision RX Labs, which is our compounding pharmacy. Um, we were really the first compounding pharmacy in, in the state. Um, I feel like I and my, my uh, boss at that time brought compounding pharmacy to North Dakota. Um, and I'm now again proud to say that we are the only accredited, PCAB accredited compounding pharmacy in North Dakota. Um, we have seven employees. They're really, really skilled people. We have unbelievable equipment um, and we are really, really good at what we do.